You might make me look a little better, but you can't fix ugly. <laughs> Queer Eye fan favorite Tom Jackson has died. He was 63. The former truck driver passed away after, quote, losing his battle with metastatic adenocarcinoma, his family confirmed in an obituary. Tom absolutely loved being a papa to his two grandsons, who were his pride and joy. A highlight of Tom's life was being cast on the Netflix show Queer Eye. He enjoyed the notoriety and shared his experience with whoever would listen, it said in part. Along with his grandchildren, he is survived by his daughter, Katie Phelps. Tom made waves when he appeared on the Netflix reboot's first episode in 2018. On Wednesday, the series posted a tribute in his honor, sharing photos from his taping and writing, it's with a heavy heart that we say goodbye to a member of our Queer Eye family. Rest in peace, Tom Jackson. Two of the show's stars mourned the loss. Tan French and Jonathan Van Ness commented, RIP Tom, and such incredibly sad news. Access Hollywood spoke to JVN in September 2021 ahead of the show's latest season, and he opened up about how the team is a special family, including the heroes. I mean, I think we're just all so, we feel so grateful to have these opportunities to be together and to be able to work with people. And we're, we just feel this is such an honor to be able to be a part of these stories and for people to let us into their homes and their lives. So I think it's more of just feeling so grateful that we can be together again. Obviously our show was affected by the pandemic and we, you know, stopped down like so many other productions for such a long time. So this season felt so special. We were back together and we um, got to see people again. So it was so special. And I think certainly we feel pressure to want to continue to do a good job and everything um, and do right by the heroes who we get to work with. Um, so in that way there's pressure, but I think we all really do love our art and our craft. And so I think we, try, at least for myself, I try to stay present and I think they do too. Something tells us y'all are going to have no problem None. continuing that great work.